So my name is Brian Henry, and this is my pet Canada goose, Honey. I've had her for about uh, seven and a half weeks since she was uh, born, and uh, we've become best friends. She was found by a friend of mine, her mother. She uh, came upon her in a park one evening, and uh, it appears as if she was the last one that had hatched in her litter, if I can call it that, and uh, her mother had already gone. So she saw a human and became imprinted to humans, and I was the next person to uh, have her after that because nobody had taken her home, and the rest is history. She's a great pet, and uh, <clears throat> she's a very unusual pet. I was gonna say she's a chick magnet. She spends the majority of her time outside. Usually I'll have her in the house when it's raining outside, or at nighttime she sleeps in the house so that she doesn't get um, lost or injured by any wild animals. You missed one right here, right here. Primarily she is in the car with me if I'm driving or if I have to go and visit, wherever I go, she goes. And when I'm at home, um, she's inside uh, with me watching television or she's just outside the window grazing on grass. I take her to the park a lot and uh, since I've had her, I've spent a lot more time outside. They do require a lot of attention. They require a lot of, um, of interaction. You go to the store, she's got to go with you. And when you get to the store, you've got to be willing to stick her in the cart and, and wheel her through if you're able to do that as well. Okay, honey, do you see anything here you want? Poop and scoop, like any other pet. Sometimes I'll make a bath and let her go in the bath, but it's a bit too big for the bath. Uh, now what I'll do is I'll, uh, I'll shower her. She does occasionally smell like a wet goose uh, when she's been outside for a while, but I'll soap her up with soap and, uh, and then she will uh, come out smelling like daisies. As you can see, she's very low maintenance because she will just sit and frolic a bit. She's a flock bird and she likes to be able to see that I'm right there. In terms of behavior, I, I prefer this much more than I do a cat or a dog. She's become quite independent as well, and, uh, and I feel that uh, if instincts are strong enough, eventually they will kick in and she will fly away and find a mate and, uh, and pick up wherever I leave off. I would be willing to keep her uh, as a pet. She lives till death do us part.